y'all. Thank you so much for stopping in today. My name is Julie. This is the Retro Apron Cooking Channel. If this is y'all's first time here, make sure you hit that subscribe button if you're interested in easy, delicious recipes on a weekly basis. Today we are fixing baked carrot cake donuts. You cannot get anything better than carrot cake or a donut, so the combination of the two has to be good, right? So let's go ahead and get started. The first thing we're going to do is preheat our oven to 350. Next we are going to beat one egg. After you beat that one egg, we're going to add a half a cup of orange juice. I chose the orange juice without pulp, but y'all do what you like. Our egg and orange juice are combined. Now we're going to add in a half a cup of completely melted butter. We're also going to add some vanilla and some brown sugar. Remember, as always, or if this is your first time here, the uh, exact recipe with the exact measurements is going to be listed down below and then also on my Instagram page, The Retro Apron, all one word. This is going to be a very runny mixture. Next, we're going to add in one cup of flour. And in this little guy, we have our baking powder, baking soda, and salt. Next is cinnamon and allspice. Our very last ingredient is our finely shredded carrots. We're just going to gently mix those in with a spatula. That's all it is to the batter. That was pretty easy, wasn't it? And we are going to load this up. There you have it. They're ready to go in the oven for about 10 minutes at 350 degrees. While they're baking, we are going to fix our glaze that we'll dip them in once they're finished baking. Our donut glaze is just one cup of confectioner sugar, a little bit of vanilla, and a little bit of heavy cream or milk, whichever you prefer. Mix that together. Our donuts are baked to perfection. We are going to take these donuts out of the pan, let them cool for two minutes, and then we're going to dip them in our glaze. And that's it. Perfectly glazed donuts. Yum. So the very last thing, you know it, it's my favorite, is we get to try it. Oh my gosh. That is so good. This is one of the easiest recipes you could ever possibly make. Make sure you check it out down below or go to my Instagram page, The Retro Apron. That's all one word. Thank y'all so much for stopping in today. Can't wait to see you next time. Bye-bye.